today I'm here with a new video and if you don't know who I am, my name is Lisa, I'm a cruelty YouTuber and today I am doing a declutter video. And it has been a while since I did one and I have just been so overwhelmed with my collection the latest and I did really realize last year when I had a no buy that I have so many things in my collection that I don't use that I've had for so long. And today I am going to decluttering lipsticks and I have really changed my preference when it comes to lipsticks. Before it was all matte, all liquid lipsticks. I have gone in more to this kind of thing. This is a fantastic from LH Cosmetics, a really sheer, super comfortable lipstick. And that is just something that I like more now. And um, yeah. I also have a lot of old lipsticks, so I guess we're just getting into it. This is the first drawer and here I have like... I try to have some more there and I guess I have some, but I'm going to take this. This is my lip, 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 lip pencils. And I think I'm just going to keep all of them because... Yeah, I'm keeping all of these. <laughs> it wasn't that long, maybe it was. But I'm keeping all of these. Then, I have two from Dose of Colors. I have Extra Saucy and also Stone. And I actually think that I would keep both of these because these aren't, they're old, <laughs> but they are not by far my oldest. And I still think they are good. Then I have four from Lime Crime, and here I actually, I do like these from Lime Crime, but they are like so, some of them are good, some of them are shit. I am going to keep Riot at least, this is, I don't have that many of like this color, so I'm going to keep Riot. That I don't know. It's some. It's one of these that are so so bad. It like looks really good, but it is so freaking dry. So it doesn't look that good on the lips. Can't remember what like this red rose. I think it's this wicked that is really bad. So I'm going to declaring this one, and then. I don't know. I think it's maybe feelings as well. Yeah. You know what? <laughs> I'm going to declutter all of these. And then I have some from the body shop and this is leaking I think. I think it's this one at least. This is... Is it you? I don't know. But I'm actually going to decluttering all of these. I do like them, but they are not like amazing and I haven't used them in... It wasn't that long ago since I used this one, but the other ones... No, I'm going to decluttering all of these. Oh, it's maybe this one that is leaking. This is from Anastasia Beverly Hills. This is the only liquid lipstick I have. And this is in Ashton. Maybe. No, I don't think it's this one. I'm going to keep this one. I do like this one. This is like a nude-ish, dark brownish nude-ish. I'm going to keep that. In the next drawer, I have some Kaleidos, Lethal, and one from Odin's Eye. All my Lethal I'm going to keep. I do love them. This is one of my absolute favorites. This is Rapture. This is a dark red one. I also do really love Riptide. This is a lighter red, more brighter red. And then I have two more neutral. I think this is the Potter and this is Anemia. No, Anemia and Potter. Keep them. And then I have this green one, Wasteland and Pneumonium. I'm going to keep them as well. And then I have this one from Odin's Eye. I I don't really like this formula. This is in Red Apple. This is a red one. And 
They are a little bit like, was it NYX matte lip cream, soft matte lip cream? I don't know if you remember those, but these are like, those were like super popular a couple of years back. What I can remember, this one is like that, and I don't like how it feels on my lips. It doesn't feel drying, but it feels like powdery, so I'm actually going to decluttering this one. And I'm really trying to be ruthless in this because I do have so many lipsticks that I don't use. Then I have these from Kaleidos and these are not my favorite if I'm going to be honest. But you know, I actually will take all my other ones from Kaleidos in the same line. So I have four of the lip kits from Kaleidos and I do not like all of these. We can just that's my drawer, and I can't like remember which ones I do like. But I know I want to keep the red ones. So is this a red or is this a pink? It's more pinkish. I'm going to keep those at least. This is Fiamma and Dahlia, so I'm going to keep these. Then I actually think that I would keep these two as well. This is a blue one. I don't have any other blue. And this is a brown one. So we keep these. This one, I don't know, it's a really like bright pink. I actually think I will decluttering this. And then other ones, this is Queen of the Night. It's really deep purple. I'm going to keep it. Rubino. Is this also red? Yeah, this is really deep red. I'm going to keep this as well. The one thing I don't like with this new lip glaze they have is I think it's a little bit too. It's not that opaque and it's a little bit hard to work with. This is Scorpio fruit. I think, yeah, I'm going to keep this because it's a cool color. But then with all of these, like, what is this for kind of color? I think this is a little bit too pink for me, so I will be cluttering this. This is, yeah, the, this I do. I don't have m much colors of this or shades of this. I can't even talk, I'm going to keep that. And it's now, I think some of these are so similar. I'm going to take away the swatches. I actually think that I will swatch all of these because it feels like they are super similar. And I do know that I like some of them. I don't know the name of these because mine, for some reason, doesn't have a name. But like, do a person need this many nudish? I think that this one and this one is kind of similar. I think I will decluttering these two. So it's done. It's them, yeah. And keep the rest. Then we're coming into more hard things. I have some more lip pencils. I'm just going to take away those. Because then I have almost all, I have all the rest of my Kaleidos and also two from Lunar Beauty. And I have this from Lunar Beauty. This is uh, Witch Bitch, which I love. I love this red and it's such a great formula and I really do like this. So I'm going to keep it. Then I bought this gloss and I... I'm not super fan of gloss, as you might know, and I actually think that I will decluttering this because it's just too sticky for me. It's kind of opaque, so I guess if you like glasses, I think this would be good, but for me that doesn't like lip glosses, it's nothing that I think is super good. So I'm going to decluttering this one. And then what like started me and wanted like why I wanted to do this decluttering was because I did use this one, Immersion. No, <laughs> this one, Immersion, not that long ago. And this smelled, it smells 
not strange, but it's not smelling like it used to, so I guess I have to decluttering this one, even though I really, really do love it. So I think I'm just going to smell these, and if they have started to smell, I'm going to declutter them. These are really, really old. I got them when they were new. But yeah, this color I've been really, really loving. I don't think it's that much left, if I'm going to be honest, but it smells a little bit strange, and it felt very strange on the lips when I last used it. It is like a lip stain, but it was more like, it was really thick. So I'm going to declaring this one. And then I also have the injection smell test. This actually don't smell, but maybe I can and this feels more like it should. Maybe I should just decluttering all of these because they are so old. This doesn't smell either. This is the third one. Let's just try it up. This is Infusion. Maybe I can keep this one. This I haven't used that much. I'm going to keep this. Then I have some Lucid Lips. It was their more lip glossy things. And should we smell? I think this is one of the oldest one. It smells a little bit funky. I'm cluttering this one. Like these, I never use these. Or, yeah, from time to time, like for some video, but, like, I am not this kind of gloss person. I think it's maybe just time for these to go. And then I have the two reds left. <laughs> and these I do really like, especially this Ambition. This doesn't smell, so I'm going to keep this. And I think this one as well. Yeah, I'm going to keep these two and this one. Then we are coming in to the next <laughs> love of my life, which is Nabla. But I think I can start with the ones that isn't Nabla. So I have this from KVD. This is Rocker can't remember what these were called, but this one I'm going to decluttering. I do really like it. It is a really shimmery lip thing, but this is so old. So, so, so old. I also have these two small lipsticks from KVD, but these I think I'm going to keep. It's underage red and double dryer. Then I have this one from Anastasia Beverly Hills. This is Rosewood. I do really like this color, but I actually I haven't used this for so long, but maybe if I swatch it, I will fall in love again. This is a nice color. I will keep this. Then I have some of my NYX liquid suede. These were some of the first liquid lipsticks that I did really, really love. These are also like super, super old. So I guess I should maybe decluttering them. But I do really want to keep this red one. This is Kitten Heels. Love it. But then, like this one is Stone Fox. This is a gray one. Which I don't have any other gray lipstick. Do you see this? But I never use this. I'm going to decluttering it. And 
this is orange count this is a really really nice orange like if you do like orange lipsticks i think this one is really for you if it, i don't know if they still have these but i think so i think i would keep this one i need something orange bright in my life okay <laughs> then the last two is San Brooklyn Thorn and Soft Spoken. I think that's this Brooklyn Thorn is really cool. Yeah, but I think it's a little bit like too cold tone for me. I don't think I'm going to use that. And then this Soft Spoken. This has been. I've been really loving this. But I think it's time for these two to go. So I gave him these two. And I'm always like, I shouldn't swatch this that much, but I, then I do and I end up like this. But okay, then I have my Nablas and I am going to keep all of these. Um, my favorites are this one, this is Unspoken. This is a really dark red. And then I love Rumors. And this one, Rogue Assassin, and is it you? Yeah, Hanging Rock is also one of my favorites. So I'm going to maybe I should be collecting this one. This is cotton. This is a like a baby blue, and I bought it because oh, that's going to be fun. Do you know how yellow your teeth looks with this on? That one. I'm going to declutter. Now we're coming in to some other favorites. I have my Magistics from LH Cosmetics. These are kind of new, at least some of the newest lipsticks I have. I'm going to keep these. I do love them really, really much. My favorite is this one, Mellow Mauve. You have seen this a lot on my channel. So I'm going to keep all of these. And I have two from Colourpop and these survived my last declutter, Liquid Courage and Better Off. Do you know how many times I've used these since my last decluttering? Nothing, so I'm going to declutter on them. Then I have this one from NYX. This is like the cheapest lipsticks and I really get why because these are I just hate this packaging, <laughs> so I'm going to be cutting this. Even though this color is really, really nice, but I don't want it. Okay, then I have some LH Cosmetics, and I see now that not all of my LH Cosmetics lipsticks is here, because I have one in my purse that is famous, that I really, really love, but I'm not going to be cutting that. So I have like all of them, but I don't actually know if I want to keep all of them. This one I know I want to keep. This is extra. This is like a see-through with some shimmer. I do really like this. This is culture red. This is like one of the newest they have. But I don't use it that much. But I don't know. Do I want to decluttering anything from LH Cosmetics? Then I have this bullseye. Do you know what? I think I'm going to keep all of these because I can use them as blush. These are multifunctional, so you can use them as a blush. So they are staying. Then I have from Colourpop and Sapphire and I guard her collab. And I'm going to actually keep these. I don't use them that much, but I do really like the colors. Oh, maybe I shouldn't keep it because it falls apart. I guess it, it has dried up, so... I guess I could... Like... Do you know what? <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not going through this. I'm going to declutter this one. Maybe I should check all of them. Fred is holding up. Screw 
creamer is holding up. Mrs. Norris is holding up. Brucey. The last one is holding up as well, which is bikini bottom. And yeah, that was a strange thing to do, but here we are. So one of them is going. I guess I could squeeze it in, but it's going to annoy the crap out of me. So I'm not doing that. The next one and here I actually have three lip glosses that I do really love. These are all from LH Cosmetics and it's Mellow Mauve, Pestle Peach and Dusty Rose. This is my absolute favorite Mellow Mauve but I also like the other two so these are going to keep and these I can really recommend if you don't like lip glosses because I am a person that doesn't and I do love these. Then I have these three from Jeffree Star. This was my... <laughs> long long love this was what made me fall in love with deep red lipsticks this is unicorn blood but i think it's time for this one to go it is kind of dry so i guess it's going then i have pumpkin pie which is an orange shimmery i'm not going to i'm declaring this one well is it time for all my Jeffree Star to go maybe and this is I'm shook the one that Jeffree Star did with many MOA oh this is so dried up so this one is going as well and I do really excuse the lighting but this is the best I can do so okay I have two from Menagerie and these I haven't used for I don't know how long so I guess I'm going to decluttering them this I think I've used once and this one I don't know the name of this I had a third one but that started to go bad I'm going to decluttering these two then I have this one from NYX this is super clicky you are like clicking this I I guess it's a nice color I'm not going to keep this I haven't used it more than once maybe <laughs> what do you think about my hand it's like never going to be clean again then I have three lipsticks from Colourpop these I do really love this is love life this is love life this is one of my favorites I do have three. Do you know what? I'm keeping all of these three. I guess in a year or so we're going to do another lipstick declutter and then I'm going to keep all of them again. And this is the only ultra Santa lip I do have left. I do really like these. And this is freaking frack. Frick frack. I can't remember that it was supposed to look like this. I'm going to decluttering this one. And then I have my KVD. And here I have, I think in my last decluttering, I did decluttering some of these. I'm going to decluttering this one now. This is not the color that I'm using. But then I think I actually going to keep the rest of them. This is a really, really nice red. And then I guess it's Lolina, Ludwig, Lolita and Sanctuary. I'm going to keep these. The last ones I have, it feels like I have been better and better with having lipsticks. I have these from Lethal Cosmetics. These are the first bullet lipsticks they came out with, I think, and I bought all nine of them. And if I'm going to be honest, these are not my favorite. I, I don't know what it is. But, uh, oh, this is, do you see this? This is moldy. Um, so I guess it's mold. I guess I'm going to decluttering this one. Do you see how good this is? So, hell to know. 
So, <laughs> should we see all of them? Mm, nope. Nope. This was easier than I thought. And I don't want to have any shade on lethal. I don't know. Or is it just... Is this maybe just oil? I don't know, but you see how this looks. Do I even want to touch it? A really thick layer. I don't want to show, throw any shade of on lethal. I know that I maybe don't store my lipsticks the best way when this is all broken off, but uh, they are not like in the sun, they are in uh, the shadow. So, yeah. This was exciting, wasn't it? Oh, you see, it's like the whole way through. And the last one. Oh, this one as well. Okay, so I'm decluttering all of these. So, okay, now I'm going to do the most fun things while doing this lipsticks decluttering. I am going to put everything back. Okay, let's see how many I'm doing going to the cluttering. So I can write here how many I did the cluttering, but I think I did really really good and it feels great from having seven drawers with lipsticks, I am down to three. It feels amazing. I really want to down downsize my collection and this feels really really good and that was the declutter i didn't think it was going to go this good i am so so happy with how good it went and i am down to three drawers with lipsticks which feels great it is the one thing that i think i want to do i want to buy <laughs> some new lipsticks um since I did my declutter, I did buy this one from NYX. This is the Fat Lip Drip Oil. Fat Oil Lip Drip, maybe. In That's Chic. I do really like this. I have used it three times, I think. I do like it. And a couple of years ago, I never thought that I was going to like a lip oil. But I also want to buy some lipstick from Nabla. Their new Shearer lipsticks i will see if i will do it though but yeah i do really hope that you will like this declutter it feels so good it feels so good to get rid of a lot of lipsticks that i haven't used for so long so i really hope that you like this video and if you're not subscribed to my channel please do and i hope i will see you in the next one and i don't know if it will be any more declutters and maybe bye